I'm James. And I'm Emily. We show you your actual weight loss journey with the Keto Lifestyle. Make sure you check us out on Instagram and Facebook, but most importantly, don't forget to get ready. Say it. Keto. All right, we're back in the kitchen. Yep. Happy <laughs> Saturday. <laughs> it's Saturday, and if yep. you're new here, every Saturday we do our weekly weigh-in. Yep. Just to keep us accountable and to give you a spot to be accountable also. Yep, and I'm going to get this started. I started, if you're new, I started out at 226 pounds. Today, I'm up 0.4 from last week, which I kind of thought I would be up more than that. Um, so I'm 150.4. My goal weight was 150. So, so now she's got to lose weight again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, this week has kind of been... A week of eating things that we don't normally eat. We usually do meat first and not very many vegetables or sauces. And this week we <laughs> we kind of had different sauces and chicken. And, and the bird's going to whistle. Yeah. So this week we've had a couple different things that we don't normally have. We normally do meat first and keep it meat based with very little veggies. And this week I've had salads and sauces and chicken and I just felt I was a little bit more lax than I normally am than sticking to mostly meat but mm -hmm. I'm okay with that it was still keto it was still and we were out of town last weekend we went with Don and Mike yes so which was an awesome time yeah just a little different stuff and we've been busy yeah and then yeah yesterday we were a little bit on the go mm -hmm. all day right we've and been on the go all week yep yeah. And as far as movement this week, we've been busy working on some projects and I got no yoga in at all, all week. None. I, I do feel little, guilty, but it's been a busy week. I got a little bit of weight training in, just a little bit, but we've been working on our studio, the room that we're turning into a, a dedicated filming area. Right. That way it'd be easier to go down. That way we don't have to set up for a half hour every time. Right. And I'll insert that little clip right here from our live the other night of where I just walked over and showed a little bit of the room. Yeah. Okay. So, yes. <laughs> we have blankets on the wall. Yeah. Blankets are on the wall. And yes, there is our, <laughs> <laughs> there's lighting, right. more <laughs> blankets on the wall, we're right. in a small area, <laughs> and yeah. <laughs> You're back at me. So yeah, that's pretty much the size of this room. Look <laughs> <That's> good. <laughs> Crazy. But... We needed a, de a dedicated space, right? Right. Yes, that is just a little dedicated space, and that will help the channel eventually. Maybe. I Hopefully. Hope, I hope. <laughs> we are. We still got sound panels to do. We still have to do a different mic. Yeah, we have a few things to do, but it's not a ton like we've done this week. And sound panels are very ex expensive to us. <laughs> They're expensive. So we're working on it. Yeah, we need we need at least probably eight to probably need at least eight, and they run about if you order them, they're about fifty to sixty dollars per panel. Nobody cares about sound sound panels. <laughs> no, in, until all of a sudden the sound sounds bad. <laughs> but sound is the single most important thing in a video. But anyway, we are going to actually make them. Yeah. So we have a project. <laughs> It's cheaper to make them. Right. But anyway, all right, so let's go to my results. I'm down 0.2. I am. I was 207 last week. I am 206.8 this week. And I started at 314 pounds on keto. That feels really unfair that you're down and I'm not. <laughs> uh, well. I'm just saying. It's okay. I'm still happy for you. But... You're a woman and you have hormones that... Crazy hormones. <laughs> Her brother Derek's down a pound. Yeah, and last week we did not catch him. His schedule is different. He is working a night shift now. Mm -hmm. um, so I caught him this morning, and last week he was at, he was down a pound last week also. So two pounds in the past two weeks. He wins. <laughs> 
So, yes, we are going, once again, we are going to Columbus again because yes. at noon we are meeting with other people for the uh, little Keto Ohio meetup. Yeah. And we're meeting at Smoky Bones in Columbus. So when you're watching this, we will be driving again. Yeah. <laughs> Seems like we're doing a lot of driving lately. That's all right. It's a lot of fun and we love seeing you guys. So, yeah, that's... About it. Uh, yesterday we ate on the run. You'll see that. You'll see what we ate during the week coming up next. Yeah. Except you won't see last weekend because we were out of town and we did not film. Yeah. I like to cherish the moment. We do. It's sometimes it's holding a camera and you don't see, you don't enjoy the moment through the lens of a camera. Yeah. So anyway, yeah, we get to see all of our friends here shortly. Yeah. And you get to see the rest of our eating week coming up. Next. Yeah. Yeah. And it's not as boring this week. We changed it up a little bit. We definitely did. All right, you guys. Take care. Have a great Saturday. Watch the rest of the video coming up. Yeah. What yeah. day is it? Monday. It's only Monday. We had a wonderful weekend with our friends Don and Mike and... Then yesterday we started a big project down in our basement. We'll show you that later. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so today? Today, James was busy. I got out the flat top and made smash burgers, a slice of Swiss cheese. I grilled some bacon and then I made some scrambled eggs when I came in. And I had to show James, remind him how it's done to make smash burgers. So now I get to find out. I get to see if they're good. If, yeah. What all the hype is about that I messed up on the last time. Yeah. <laughs> but um, really quick, I want to show you something. We got a package in the mail from our good friend, Hyla. Or hookah. hookah. It's hookah. It's hookah um, at Crafty and Carnivores. And it is the cutest thing ever. So I'm going to grab it right now. Okay. First off, this adorable adorable diaper caddy and bacon and i have to show you this this is so stinking cute it says new to the crew and then it has little pants that go with it that say little man not just that but a little hat that says little man and it's so stinking adorable <laughs> do you think if i shave my Mustache and goatee, mm -hmm. and wore that hat. Yeah, you yeah. think I would look like a baby? No, I'd be a baby. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait. So it's gonna be wonderful having a little baby around. All right, I'm having exactly what she had, except I'm probably gonna have a fourth smash burger because I'm not eating them eggs. Oh wait, wait, wait! I gotta show something else too. Oh no. I'm not having these, but at Costco like a week ago, mm -hmm. I picked up these. Almost dropped them. <laughs> Cauliflower. It's sandwich called, thins? Sandwich thins by Outer Isle. Has Noah eaten them? And Noah just ate oh. and used one. Um, you're not going to like them. Oh, no. He's not going to like them. He said they taste like cauliflower. They're made with cauliflower and like a chopple. But the ingredients are super clean. It's just cauliflower, um, whole cage-free liquid eggs. Parmesan cheese, milk, cheese culture, salt enzymes, and nutritional yeast. And I cannot read how many total carbs that says. That's because it's very small. It was very made, tiny. They make these for young people. Yeah. I believe it's three. And that's total carbs in two of these thins. And that's how thin they are. Um, Noah just had it. He loves cauliflower and he said it tastes just like cauliflower, but he absolutely loved it. He had a Pepper. double cheeseburger. Um, I might have to try a piece. Yeah, but he loved it. I picked them up because I thought they would be good to make like little pizzas to make little pizzas out of it. So. All right. See you tomorrow. Yeah. What's up? Hmm. <laughs> So we have a project going on right now. You want to tell everybody what we're doing? Yes. We love you guys so much that we are turning, and Emily decided to turn her art room. Into a guest room. And I decided to turn my 
gym. It was our gym slash art room. Right. Into a studio so that we could have better sound. Even though it's echoey now, it's because there's nothing in here. So yesterday I went and tore the table off that was yeah. here. It was attached to the wall. Of course, then it had holes everywhere and had to be patched. But yeah. right here is where the leg went down. And they had actually put the carpet around the leg. So that when we moved it, there was a big chunk of carpet missing. So we cut it up. We ran to Lowe's at 7 o'clock last night. Got carpet. And I installed carpet for the second time in my life. Last night was the first time, and last night was the second. Meaning, that was the first and last time I will ever do carpet again. <laughs> because it was awful. <laughs> but, it only took an hour and 15 minutes to totally screw everything up. So, that was the bright side. <laughs> so, yes. RSK. <laughs> yes, we are painting. And what we want to do is, is, so we are going to keep like our way in Saturday. And of course, recipe videos will be in the kitchen. But for our lives and when we do interviews and stuff, we want to have a more acoustic room because audio is very important. So that is our goal right now. And visual. We'll figure something out. Emmy will put something together and it'll be beautiful and orange. <laughs> so that's what we're doing on Monday. And it's going to take a few days. But we'll show you. We'll show yeah. you when we're all done. We'll show updates. Yep. Goodbye, Art Studio. Hello, friends. Right? Hello, friends. It's Tuesday. And I am back to working on the studio. So we did get everything trimmed, as you can see behind me. We got everything trimmed, and now that's the room. It's eight by eleven, or it's like eight. I guess you could say it's nine by twelve because it's like eight and a half by eleven and a half. Anyway, we got it all trimmed. I'm getting ready to roll it out. I had a little bit of painting or sanding to do right there. But I'm going to try to get this rolled out real quick before Emily gets home so we can cook dinner. And then I have a table to put together. So, yeah, that's my Tuesday. You can see this is, this is actually how big the room is. It's basically a bedroom. It's not, it? it's not Tuesday. What is it? It's Wednesday. It's hump day. <laughs> and why didn't, what happened, what happened to Tuesday? Oh, we didn't film at all, did we? Uh -uh. I did not feel like cooking. That's what happened. So I had the best salad ever, my go-to salad. And it is essentially a taco salad, but it's not. It is just lettuce and tomato and steak and guacamole. And I put green chilies. I get green chilies on the side. And put that on there. And what else is on there? I think that's it. Guac, steak, tomatoes, green chilies. It is delicious. The best salad ever. Yep. We went to Chewy's last night because yep. nobody wanted to cook. Yeah. And they have a jalapeno ranch. I know it's not the best ingredients, but the combination of that ranch and the green chilies, it's so good. All right. So I made it for tonight. Yep. So I made lasagna. <laughs> Lasagna, and it is, like it. instead of noodles, it is just adding meat, Lunch layers meat. of meat and cheese. I even added a layer of pepperoni, all pepperonis, like a, on, a, on a pizza, except it was pretty tight so that every bite might have pepperoni in it, unless yeah. it falls off. But, How is it, Noah? He, so, he did thumbs yeah, up. It is, and then we only had eight ounces, or I was thinking maybe a pound of mozzarella wasn't enough. <laughs> So I broke up like five um, cheese heads, uh, string cheese, mm -hmm. and I shredded them and I like weaved it on the top. Yeah. So, so yeah. basically it's what ground beef, there's ham, there's pepperoni, yep. Yep. there's cheese, there's rouse, um, pasta sauce. Yep. Three pounds of hamburger, ricotta cheese, eggs, 
couple eggs, parmesan, parmesan, parsley, all that mixed into the ricotta cheese that was bread. Yeah, he listened to my advice. A whole layer of pepperoni, and then it was just ham and turkey breast for noodles. Yeah. And while he was doing that, I came home and I took, picked up Noah and took him to get his haircut. Haircut. And Noah has sauce on his chin. <laughs> All right. So. Yeah. So sorry we didn't post last night, but sometimes life happens. But that is why you should check us out on Instagram. I try to post our food every day. Um, if not every day, most days. But that salad is on our Instagram. So other than other than some peanuts and a bite of string cheese while I was making this, that's all I had today. Yeah. So see you later. It's Thursday. Happy Thursday. <laughs> All right, so. Can you see the steam coming from my plate? Emily made chicken masala. Yes, keto version. This is a recipe that my brother Nathan sent to me um, a couple months ago, and I've been wanting to make it. And I had a hard time finding Graham masala season. And the dishwasher's spices. running. The dishwasher's running, and we're very sorry. Yeah. So, not my recipe, but it was super easy, and I can't wait. I love Indian food, and so this was a recipe I've been wanting to try. So I'm happy. I already tried a piece of this chicken just now. It's really good. All right, I and can't wait to eat. And we're getting ready to go live in 35 minutes. Yep. So we have to eat fast because... Mm -hmm. We have to make sure that we're all ready. All our I's are dotted and our T's are crossed because we're filming in a different spot. Yeah. <laughs> so I hope that goes off without a hitch. Hey, real quick. I got hungry today and I decided today was too mad for me. Too mad? Yeah. So I went to the gas station. I wasn't too mad at all. And so I had a hot dog with yeah. mustard and hard boiled eggs from the gas station. I haven't been mad at all. I've been in a good mood. Hot dog eggs and what? Hot dog. Hot dog and mustard. Yep. Was that an all beef? It said beef hot dog, but we know how that is. Yeah. Beef <laughs> and soybean. Yeah, I just figured it would be the quickest route to run up to the gas station and get a beef hot dog, beef hot dog, and hard boiled eggs. You no, know, you can always take a keto brick or two and leave them. I know. Dinner. I keep forgetting, and I ate all the um, keto brick. Yeah. After dinner yesterday, at the rest, I ate the rest of the keto. Brick pucks, maybe they're smaller than pucks. Yeah, that's Thursday. Yeah, happy Friday! It is Friday, <laughs> and we are going to a horror convention. And it is a huge convention that my brother and my cousin put on. and. Yeah, we're going to go and support them and see some family members who are going to be there and some friends that we haven't seen in a while. And we got Noah. And we have Noah. His foot. That's Noah saying hi with his foot. Yep. And since we both had to work today and we're off, we're going to show you real quick we picked up food to go. Wendy's triples. Yep. Wendy used triples. And Noah, did you have the same as us? Yep. <laughs> Noah ate his before I even got the container salt on mine. Yeah. <laughs> and mayo. Right. I so, yeah, we have a little bit of a busy weekend heading to uh, the Horror Hound convention and going to hang out there and then go home and Get up in the morning. We're going to the Keto Ohio meetup up in Columbus. So we're going back to Columbus tomorrow. All right, so if you're watching this, this is the end of the video. And we are actually on our way to Columbus again. Yeah. And we hope that we see you there. Yes. Can't wait to give you big hugs and love you guys so much. And can't wait to see you if you're going to be there. And Thank you so much for watching. And if you weighed in today, don't forget to leave a comment down below. Let us know how you did. You yeah. Don't, you don't actually have to leave your weight. You can just leave how you did. If you're up or down or right. whatever holds you accountable. Yes. Whatever helps you stay accountable is 
the best thing possible. So you already seen our way in and hopefully I was down like eight pounds. Well, you know, it's been a busy week. Seven. <laughs> seven pounds. Hopefully I'm down seven pounds. Right. So yeah. See you later. See you soon.